Alright, what's going on dudes and welcome back to Minecraft. This time we'll be going over a new mod, the Pet Buddies mod to be more specific, and it kind of does just what the name would suggest, in that once you install the mod and load up a world, you get your very own Pet Buddy version of yourself, by default, at least. So this is my mini-me guy, and he's already telling me he thinks he found something. So according to the description on the mod page, I think if I right-click on him, he'll... Why did he do this? <laughs> All of a sudden, he is a chicken, and he gave me seven feathers. What a guy. Okay, so now that he's done this unexpectedly, well, let's go ahead and, and I'll show you that if I walk far enough away, he should follow me around now as a chicken. Um, that's a pretty quick chicken, if I do say so myself. Um, but this brings up a, a perfect time to, to show you that if I right click on him in creative mode it'll bring up a different menu um, than in survival so let me since we're in creative mode right click on him with a stick and it brings up this whole nifty menu right here so by default um, as I showed you initially he is my skin but apparently he found some feathers and he decided to give them to me and turn into a chicken at the same time so that's cool um, but if we want to revert him back to me I can just click uh, Tiny Me in that menu, and now he's back to being me. So another feature is if we right-click on him with no stick in hand, um, and when he says he doesn't have any items to give me, then he will be on my dad ass. <laughs> I can't say I was expecting that, but I guess I should have, knowing my skin. Um, yeah, anyway, so he's on... Our head. If we go into F5 mode, there he is. He's hovering slightly above our head. He's got some magical powers, not a big deal or anything like that. And uh, yeah, he'll just ride around on top of us until we click on Dad Ass again with a right click, and then he will dismount. And again, if we walk around, he will uh, he'll follow us. So those are sort of the basics. Now again, if we right click on him in creative mode, um, once again, creative mode is an important point there. It brings up this menu and we can, I don't know, switch him to uh, whatever we want. So first let's rename him and for whatever reason I have to hit backspace every time I can't just hold delete and delete the whole thing. Um, I don't know, what do we want to name him? Mini me. And then if we submit the name, changes his name, and there we go. He is now mini me. We go back into the menu, we can choose uh, a different model for him. So say we want a little zombie. And they also have the uh, the sound effects, I might add. So if you choose a zombie, for example, he will have the zombie sounds. Also, pretty cool, there are, uh, I think, some non-Minecraft non sounds in there. Because if we choose dragon, he kind of sounds like a lion. And it's kind of awesome. Although... I don't know. I haven't listened to the Ender Dragon in a long time, so those may actually be the actual Ender Dragon songs. They probably are, actually. But he kind of sounds like a lion anyway. So, anywho. <laughs> Here we go. He will follow us around. This is this is kind of a cool skin. I'm not gonna lie. And, uh, again, if we right cl didn't Didn't mean to change him back into a chicken, but that does bring up a, a good next point. <laughs> <laughs> which is that um, whether you're in survival or creative, this more applies to creative. So let's actually go ahead and give ourselves a, a few ap applicable items and then we'll uh, switch on over into um, survival mode. Um, so let's see, I don't know, we'll give ourselves a nether star and an ender pearl and you can probably see where this is going already and I don't know, uh, cooked pork chop. And now, if we switch on over into survival mode, and we right-click on our dude with these various items, I bet you can take sort of a wild guess as to uh, what's going to happen. So, Nether Star, he becomes a, a mini wither, which is kind of nifty. And uh, if we right-click on him, if we right-click on... Come on! There's his hitbox. We have a wither on top of our head. I was going to do that with the, with the dragon, but then I accidentally right clicked on him with a feather instead of with my fist, so he turned into a chicken. But anyway, now we have a wither on top of our head, so that's kind of nifty. Um, also, if we right click on him with an ender pearl, you can probably see where this is going. <laughs> it threw it and turned him into a mini enderman. Um, cooked pork chop. It turns him into... There are actually 
a few like non Minecraft mobs. I don't know if they're from another mod or if they're like just he modeled them for this mod in particular, but this is like it's called like the RPG boar, I think. And then um, if we go back into hold on slash game mode creative. Let's see, what were the other ones? I didn't mean to get them on my head. All right, off off with you. Um, there is the RPG bull, which is like this raging red-eyed bull with horns. And then there's the RPG spider, if I can find that, which is kind of a terrifying looking spider. Yeah, so I'm probably gonna take a pass on having my pet buddy be that spider. Let's go ahead and uh, make my pet buddy what I would probably have him if he were in the game with me. So let us slash game mode back into survival. So say we were in survival and uh, we were using the mod and stuff. First thing I would probably do is go and collect a slime ball and I would click on my pet buddy with the slime ball and then I'd collect a stick. And I right click on him with the stick and in survival when you right click on him with the stick rather than having the whole menu where you can choose different options for what you want to uh, to change him into you can only rename you have to change models by using the actual corresponding items and then I would go into this menu and I would name him Jerry and I would submit the name and then we have an invulnerable Jerry that would follow us around and I forgot to mention earlier that yes they are invulnerable so basically we have jerry 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 lives jerry is freaking fast <laughs> and jerry is invincible so as we wind down on the end of the day i'm just gonna share some moments with with jerry and we're gonna hang out because he is now once again my pet buddy and he will follow me forever and uh he will be invincible and it will be wonderful so anyway um, thank you guys for watching. If you've enjoyed, a rating would be much appreciated. And other than that, I think that Jerry and I are gonna hang out for a little bit. We got some catching up to do. And uh, again, if you have any interest in the mod, you can find a link to the forum page in the description. And on that note, uh, we'll see you next time.